was tweeting uh, that they couldn't show us a question that they needed an answer to. So that's why I believe they only wanted him for the pur purpose of trapping him into perjury. So you're saying that, that Mueller and his team didn't act honorably because you said they were setting a perjury trap. You're you didn't walk right, into didn't. it. Yeah, uh, you're darn right they didn't act honorably. Look what they did to Manafort. They got him in solitary confinement. And they it, go question him every four days and try to get him to lie. But is there a conflict? I mean, after a while, is after there a, a while, after a while, that gets close to subordination of perjury. The first four times, four, first four times, a guy you're bringing out of solitary tells you it didn't happen the way you want me to say it. By the fifth or sixth time, you're getting pretty darn close to suborning perjury. Luckily, Manafort wouldn't lie. So you're saying they didn't act honorably, but their conclusion is the correct one. I mean, they had is that no a choice. contradiction? Not at all. They had no choice. What are they going to do? Make things up? Uh, they had no choice. Uh, they, there's no evidence. They can't create it. They tried darn hard to create it. So he was cleared by a biased staff because hard as they tried, however many rules they just ignored, they couldn't get what they needed because, how about this, Judy? It didn't happen. There was no collusion and there was no obstruction. Will the president, do you think, pardon any of the people who were indicted uh, uh, and found guilty under a, by, by Robert Mueller, whether it's Michael Flynn, Paul Manafort, anybody else? I was asked that question by numerous reporters during the investigation. I was asked that question by some lawyers. And the answer is always the same. The president is not going to consider pardons. He's not going to give any pardons. If that happens, it has to happen in the future. And nobody has a promise of it. Nobody should assume it. But he obviously, he has the power to do it, but I have no reason to believe he's going to exercise it. Former New York City Mayor Rudy Giuliani, <laughs> attorney Thanks, to the Judy. president. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.